you very much indeed. Um, Steve mentioned that there are four types of barrier that prevent uh, institutions collaborating and, uh, well, sharing services, one of them being collaboration of HEIs. I was wondering whether you felt that there are particular barriers which are formed between the collaboration be between large HEIs and smaller institutions, and if so, how, how those barriers could be removed? Uh, Steve and then Chris, I think. Okay. So, those barriers are different in that, uh, and, and sometimes they work extremely well, and I can think of um, Imperial College and the Royal College of Music right next door to one another, and actually the, the bigger one of those actually services the smaller one of those uh, very, very well, and they, they, they are patriarchal towards their smaller, smaller neighbour, and, and that relationship works extremely well. So we can't pitch it that actually some of these things don't work well because of size, but certainly uh, size does play a part. Um, and there are always fears uh, when getting into these sorts of arrangements and there is a much larger partner um, that, uh, that that partner will, have, the larger partner will have a larger voice, a larger say in how things will operate and therefore uh, the, the smaller players may walk away just for that reason rather than trying to work through those issues, surfacing those issues and getting to some sort of of happy uh, modus operandi with all parties. Um, and again, that may be because it's just too difficult and there are other priorities. So some of those other things that I've listed may come into play in that. Mm. 